Hey everyone, so um, I'm eating some pizza because I'm starving. Um, anyway, I don't understand the violent stuff that Delightful Hug is posting. Like before, she used to post real sweet, really consensual stuff. Um, I mean, she's, she's gorgeous. I don't know why she does that stuff. It makes me uncomfortable. It's like, I just got a message from a guy. I won't give out his name on Reddit. But he said the same thing. He's like, it makes me very uncomfortable. And it does. How could anyone be turned on by that? Having a girl being brutally slapped in the face. And letting girls and guys slapping you in the face. What the hell? I mean, she could easily be a model or something. She's gorgeous. Has an amazing body. I love that one boob is a little bigger than the other. Because she's natural. And, uh... I just don't know why, like, you're a woman. It's like you shouldn't let someone slap you in the face. Like, it makes you uncomfortable. It's like this guy's, like, grat, like, force feet. Like, it's crazy how some guys... Force a girl to give them a blowjob. And then brutally start grabbing their face and squeezing on their face and slapping them in the face. It's like. And then she's got like all these markings. It's like that's just psychotic to me. I don't get that shit. I dated a girl that was crazy like that. She wanted me to slap her in the ass. And I said, no, I may say uncomfortable. I would never, ever slap somebody. I'm not doing that. And she even slapped me a couple times. I was like, hey, don't slap me. So I'm not into that weird ass. Kinky shit. I'm not into abuse. I'm not into it. I mean, well, then again, if you get into that kind of an industry, there's something wrong that has happened to you psychologically. I mean, nobody wakes up one day and goes, I want to be a porn star or I want to be a stripper. No one decides to be a stripper. But it is sad, though, when you see them on stage and it's like a lot of them were abused. You know? I mean, do you think they like to enjoy their job? They don't. They hate their job. But when you make that kind of money... It's irresistible to them. But some people have more morals than others. I would never do it. I would rather work in a field. You know. Getting vegetables for $7 an hour before I do something like that. I would rather make an honest day's living. I need to use my body for something as grotesque as that. I mean, and think about the culture of mental illness that portrays in pornography as well as viewership. I mean, when you really think about... Look at all the mental illness that expands from uh, pornography to the viewer. 
I mean, it's not normal. I mean, when people get into relationships, a lot of people are acting out exactly what they do in those pornos. And a lot of them are violent. And they're derogatory towards black people. They're derogatory towards women. I mean, come on, think about it. You can't be a feminist and be in porno. That's just stupid. I mean, there's girls being choked and slapped. That's not feminism. Like, there was this girl, I forgot her name, but I remember she was in the news because she talked about how she was a feminist. And everyone called her out on it. They go, that is stupid. You can't be a feminist and be in porno. And I agree. I mean, it's stupid. She's, like, in college. I forgot her name. She's, like, she goes to college and she does porno to pay for school. And it's, like, you can't call yourself a feminist and be in porno. When you let guys forcefully slap you and choke you and do disgusting things with you, it's not, you can't call yourself a feminist if you do, if you allow people to do that to you. I don't get that, you know? But, um, but yeah, a lot of that stuff disturbs me. I mean, like, all the slapping, the choking, the spitting, the, where they grab a girl and they do, like, throat fucking, like, it's just gross, like, what the fuck happened to porno, like, when I, you know, the first time I looked at it was, like, 12 or 13, it was nothing like that, although the first porno I watched was transgender, but, (laughs) but, um, but no, some of these pornos today are just so disturbing, not all girls are like that, and a lot of them are freaks because of that, too, And then they think guys will like that. And I'm not, you know, to think that every guy or every girl is into that is wrong. I'm a guy and I'm not into that stuff. So, um, but yeah, I mean, I don't get it. I don't get the violent stuff. I'll never understand that. Um, but anyway, thanks for listening to the podcast. Um, I'm going to try to go to sleep, but thanks for listening.